I have made a PPA with uh, a new package in it to make Ubuntu SDK C++ packages um, with a wizard. So if we go to File, Add New Project, Virtual Ubuntu, we pick out that. We give it a name, say uh, we next we pick out our kit. Uh, you might only have one of these, but I'll, I'll just select the canonical, the Ubuntu SDK one. Press next, fill out a description and your versioning of your number of your what your package number is. We will enter in the description. You enter in your name. Enter in your email address. You enter in your home page if you have one. If not, you can just use the launch pad. And you enter in your license. The license still needs some uh, work. Press next, add a version control if you want. And you can see that it adds the Debian files, it adds the QML files, it adds the desktop file, and some C++ to make st stuff into a binary. And if we go through all that stuff that we were just filling out, it fills in. You can see the home page needs some work, and the copyright needs some work. But and then it gives you a desktop file and so on and so forth. Here's our QML. I'll just run it. This is just stock. You'll see it'll compile. And it's going to run it. And this is just our typical app. Right? Just to change it, just to show. save it, run it, there it is, and if we actually go and look underneath where we had set our project up, we can see that we have a binary package in here now, and we can run the binary package. And there we go. I'll leave the uh, package, the uh, PPA stuff in the description below.